morning, another uh, Odark 30 uh, drive through uh, Yesterday was an interesting day. It was a long day, but had two very extreme different types of meetings. One meeting uh, was, so, was with uh, some kids, and uh, they were 10, 11, 12 years old. And what the objective was to talk to them about why their parents owned the business, uh, what they were, um, why they owned the business, the value of it. Uh, these people live well, and so part of the fear was that the focus would be on money. So we talked about Iron Man. Um, we talked about delivering ideas to people. Uh, we got really silly. We played a little popcorn exercise game. And as we did this, it fired up their imaginations to begin to think about one of them wants to own a space station one day. So the key to it, and the parents were a little watching what was going on, wondering uh, if this was a good idea. But the reality was we captured the kids' imaginations and have got them thinking and tying into their world today where they might be able to possibly go as adults. And it's not tied to money or living well. It's tied now more to who they are as a person, their values, um, using wisdom, using smarts, all that kind of thing. By the same token, there was a leadership team of kind of curmudgeonly guys I met with later in the day, and we talked about very similar things. Now, we didn't necessarily talk about Iron Man and didn't draw silly pictures or in any of that, but trying to capture their imagination is going to give fuel to the fire. And so that meeting was also a great meeting because by capturing their imagination, we were able to drive a lot deeper thinking and commitments to action. So you've got to capture people's imagination, whatever walk of life, to cause great things to happen. So the question you is, are you grabbing people's imaginations? Is your process, your way of interacting, engaging people where their, their imagination will grab them and when you're not there, drive powerful behavior and actions? So another drive-through. Thank you.